Hi, this is Michael Sandler again answering your bankruptcy questions. Uh, one question that has come up uh, a lot recently is, do I have enough debt to file a Chapter 7? Um, recently, I have been filing a number of cases with less debt. Uh, it used to be that pretty much every case seemed to be thirty, forty, fifty thousand dollars $50,000. A lot of time uh, recently, I've been filing cases that have ten dollars or $15,000. There's no rule about how much debt you need to have to file a Chapter 7. Uh, one thing to keep in mind is that it is going to cost you close to $2,000 to do a Chapter 7 case, um, potentially a lot more if you use another attorney. And so, you know, are you getting your money's worth uh, given what it costs? So if you only have $5,000 worth of debt uh, and you're paying $2,000 or more in attorney's fees, is that really worth it? But the other thing to consider really is that bankruptcy should be your last option. Um, it shouldn't be the first thing that you're looking to do. If you can pay off your debt, um, you know, in two, three, four years, and that probably is the way to go rather than filing bankruptcy. Um, bankruptcy is something you should consider if you just have been trying and you can't get on top of your debt and it's affecting your life. Uh, and of course, if you're getting sued and or garnished, then it can make it impossible to, to pay your rent or keep your car. Um, but as to a minimum or maximum amount of debt in a Chapter 7, there is none. If you have any questions regarding your case um, or uh, regarding income or, or debt, uh, please give us a call or shoot us an email. Hi, this is Michael Sandler with Fisher Sandler answering your quick bankruptcy questions with quick answers. So one question that comes up from time to time uh, is people want to know if bankruptcy has any kind of